Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello friends How are you today? I'm fine too, thank you Oke, okay, now with Miss Anis We will learn about mathematics Before we start our lesson Let's pray Pray begin Amin Oke, okay, you can see this video until the end And then you can answer the question in this video And you can submit your answer to your teacher class Oke, okay, let's see the video We will learn about comparing numbers and rounding numbers So, listen carefully and then you can watch this video until the end Comparing numbers By comparing, we can define or find by how much a number is greater or less than Let's see the sign we can use for compare the number First, this sign it's mean greater than Second, this sign it's mean less than Third, this sign it's mean equals Comparing numbers First, when there are an equal number of digits Let's look down Comparing 23 and 678 678 consists by 3 digits number 23 consists by 2 digits number We can compare this number The number with more number of digits is greater So we can use greater sign We can read from left 678 greater than 23 Second example is Comparing 78,945 and 3,456 3,456 consists by 4 digit number And then 78,945 consists by 5 digit number So we can choose 78,945 is more number of digits Because we read this number from left We can use less than sign And we can read 3,456 Less than 78,000 945 Do you understand? Yeah. Comparing numbers The second, when they are equal number of digits Comparing 1,423 and 1700 We can see they are consist by 4 digits number We can look from the left of number At the thousand digits They are consist by 1 It means same We cannot compare So Let's compare to the next digit 4 and 7 4 is less than 7 So we can use less than sign 1423 less than 1700 Or we can reverse because in hundreds, seven is greater than four, we can use greater than. We can read 
1700 greater than 1423 the next example is comparing 2345 and 2340 we can see from the left of number let's see the thousands digits thousand digits same we can move to hundreds digits and then the hundred digits is same three and three we can move to see tens digit tens digit is same four and four plus we can see the units or ones digit they are five and zero so we can use greater than because 5 greater than 0 2345 greater than 2340 or we can reverse because 0 is less than 5 we can use less than sign we can read 2340 Less than 2345. Okay, I have some question for you, and we can answer it together. Use the less than or greater than sign to make these statements true. We can compare from the left of number. Number 1, 320 is less than or greater than 350. Your answer is... Good job! Less than. So, 320 is less than 350. Number 2, 770 is less than or greater than... 70 and 7 Your answer is Nice The answer is Greater than So 770 is greater than 70 and 7 Number 3 1000 is less than or greater than 980 your answer is exactly greater than so 1000 is greater than 980 the last one number 4 4250 is less than or greater than 4252 your answer is Correct. Less than. So the answer is 4250 is less than 4252. Next about rounding numbers. Vocabulary you must know is round to the nearest. To round the nearest hundreds. Look at tens. How to round numbers? Numbers less than 5 round down. And number more than 5 or same as 5 such as 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 round up. For example 1, round this number to the nearest 100. I have numbers 
4260 you can see there are three steps to round the number to the nearest 100 step one let's look at the tens tens digits the tens digit is six and then step two is identify the ten less or more than five or same as five six is more than five so next to step three if tens more than or same as five add one four hundreds and change the number behind the hundreds into zero so the answer is four thousand and three hundred for example two round this number to the nearest 100 I have numbers that is 3524 there are the steps step one look at the tenth digit the ten digit is two and step two identify the ten less or more than five or same as five two is less than 5 so to the next step if 10 less than 5 it's no need to add 1 for hundreds and change the number behind the hundreds into 0 so the answer is 3500 Okay, this is the exercise You can write this exercise on your notes And you can answer this exercise Okay, maybe it's enough for today. Thank you for watching this video. And then don't forget to do your exercise. See you on next video. Bye-bye. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.